Hello, welcome to the second round. Uh, I'm gonna mulligan this hand just because we don't have a forest. Uh, this hand is a bit better, we have some current noble into Tarmogoyf. Uh, depending on what my opponent plays, of course, this can be a good hand or can, this can be a bad hand. Uh, but I think it's obviously better than our previous one because that one wasn't that good. Uh, we draw more lands, which I actually don't mind. Uh, opponent F6, so he doesn't have Source Splash there or Path of Exile here. Uh, he seems to be mono red as well, or at least a red deck. Um, so let's attack here, see what he does. Uh, he F6 again, so doesn't have it here. Uh, we're gonna play Tarmogoyf. Sure, it's an 0 1 now, but uh, with how Rider it actually has value as well. Banisher Priest, yeah. That's a good one. Uh, takes care of most of my things. Uh, can't actually cast that. Wow, this 2 2 is actually uh, obscured now. God damn it, I need a. <laughs> I need a mountain just for Hellrider, Hellkite, and so on. Uh, opponents is not playing anything here. <laughs> this white Tarmogoyf is, is, isn't that great of a card. Uh, Limvala. I guess it's a fine card, but um, we'll just museum markers that. And then Tarmogoyf grows, and then we can smash with it. Is casting is immortal just correct? I think it is just because Tarmogoyf grows. Uh, that's a good one. I read over the fat Miss Immortals for that, of course, but. Uh, let's just attack here. See if he blocks. He doesn't. Uh, don't think I can win this right now. Talia doesn't actually make the difference here. We can get a Stormkirk back. But I think killing Talia is better. He F6 again. Mountain? Of course not. Uh, let's keep the timer going behind. Damn Archangel. I can't actually get rid of it right now. Uh, yeah, let's concede this. Like, just not drawing a uh, lens here. It's pretty bad for me. Um, I don't want din against this guy. Do I even want anything against this guy? I don't think I do. I think my deck should be good enough. Maybe fire spot, but seems unlikely. Uh, just think my yeah no I I had to mulligan my opening hand because that would be been even worse than the other hand, but then the other hand wasn't that as good either. Uh, it did have a good start, but Banisher Priest totally locked it up, and then I had to kill Invala. Uh, he's mul uh, he's changing his deck up, so he hasn't seen much. Come on, not gonna mulligan this. Like um, we're behind, we need to have a good opening. Um, so we just need to draw land here, and then we can cast Orin Viper, which is basically what I want to do here. Draw land, yeah, baby. Uh, Orin Viper, really good card here. Unless he can get rid of it, but uh, kill the Marauders is a good one against it. Uh, we might be able to draw another land. We do. In which case, we make a tree tree. Uh, not gonna attack with the Viper here. I don't see why it would. Uh, kill the Marauders is gonna die next turn anyway. Uh, another Banisher Priest, probably on the token. Then he attacks Garak. I think. Yeah, we're gonna block that. Like, uh, I think having Garak making tokens is better than. Um. Oh yeah, he can redirect it to the Garak. That's fine. He did. 
Uh, burst lighting on that doesn't do much. And then next turn Polycranes can wipe a lot of creatures. Mother of Runes, yeah that's gonna die. Mother of Runes, oh Polycranes. A Banisher Priest, really? Attack Garruk. I think I have to protect it here again. Uh, kill Banisher Priest, get Polychronus back, have 5 mana, kill Mother Runes. Yeah. Um, can we, we have 1 mana, so we need 4 then. I know, so we just need two more. Um, because we can't go three. Man, his draw is so strong so often. Banisher Priest is just being the nuts here. Yeah, bird tokens. Uh, deck with Polygranus. Oh, wow. And then just uh, make it three three. Like he he can kill this, but uh, I don't think he can afford attacking with a mirror here. Shrine, yeah, doesn't do much. <laughs> okay. So he has four blockers now. Uh, he can't afford to attack here because if he does, he dies. And he can't even afford to block like. I don't see him winning this. Despite his good opening, uh, that counted my opening a little bit. Uh, we just attack with these. Yep, yep. And then you have to block the beast as well. Yeah, I thought so. So, um, has a bunch of flyers. That's for sure. Um, maybe I want Cordin. No, I still think my deck is good enough. Like Fire Spot does seem good though. Fire Spot over Sater, over Zealots, over Noble. Try that. Let's try Fire Spot. It seems weird, but I think Fire Spot is actually pretty good against him. Um, he mulligan, so I'm gonna keep this. Uh, it's a terrible hand because I need a forest, but I always need a forest apparently. And there we have it. We have the forest. He burns it. God damn it. <laughs> forest? That's not a forest. Shrine, sure. Forest? Just as good. Ah, oh, come on, really? So he plays land, doesn't do anything, I draw land, look at the top again. 
So finally see my first ten, but um, is it gonna be in time? That's a good question. Uh, because we have forest into Fenchfine, into Domri, plus burst. Uh, Shrine is taking up though, so it can take care of Domri next turn. Oh, Hero of Oxid Ridge. That's actually really good for me. Because I can easily kill that. And then we'll look at the top again. See another mountain. Cast a bench fine. Smash his face in. Kill the Marauders, sure. Uh, redirect to Domri, you shrine, kill Domri. All seems good. He just has two cards anyway, so. Uh, Domri didn't actually gave me a lot of advantage, but. Man, you're shitting me, right? Uh, let's just cast Garak here. Make a beast. Pass the turn. I'm surprised he didn't kill Domri with Shrine. I mean, I have missed every single time now, but. So he can kill Garak with the Mind Sensor. But I have a 3 3 beast for that now. Is he finally gonna pop the shrine on the Domri? No, just a banisher priest again. I mean, just uh, getting pretty tired of his head, but. He hasn't played land. That attacks Domri. I think I'll let it hit Domri. I think that's fine. Uh, he has a land, so we can shrine it now. Um, should get this fine. Finally, a hit with a real big creature. Sorry for that, uh, just typing to someone. Um, how the game is looking, I think it's actually looking pretty good. Like, he just has one card. Uh, seems unlikely that it's uh, the nuts. Um, the fact that he hasn't used Shrine yet seems really weird. Uh, so he knows about the Satyr. I think we just uh, rancor this up. can then kill the viper if he shrines the viper do I run Zillus conscript on banisher priest he has to do something with that shrine though so yeah he shrines the viper about time um, this is 7 this is 8 yeah I think I'll 
Let's see where this brings me. He has to have the removal now. And he doesn't. Uh, so we go to Will, and I'll see you guys for the next one.